this video shows how to use MDI. Let's say we want to transmit a stream over MDI, which is the multiplex distribution interface of a network, and we don't want to use OFDM modulation. Okay, what we're going to do is we adjust the DRM settings to our uh, target settings, which is mode B and let's say we use unequal error protection let's use different code rates here and go to the multiplexer add an AAC plus stream take the full bandwidth okay and let's add a text message here our text message just to find the headline maybe rename the service to our service accept that okay and then we go to the transmitter output settings and there we can see you can change the transmission mode from DRM over OFDM which means the OFDM modulation is actually done over the analog output device like a sound card we change it to DRM over MDI okay Let's have a look at the MDI settings. We use the PFT layer, which is a transport layer above the AF layer. And we don't use the transport layer here because we're not interested in addressing uh, our packets. Okay. The timestamp delay, let's say it's one second. If you are interested in the parameters like uh, the timestamp delay or uh, the PFT layer, you can look up uh, look it up in the specification, in the MDI specification and the DCP specification. Okay, that was it. That's all of the configuration you have to do to get it up and running. So let's hit the start button and see if it works. There you see the MDI output window and this is again me speaking this is our text message and so on and so forth and the output status um, the number of packets uh, which have been sent and uh, some of the important settings you made in the MDI configuration in the transmitter tab okay let's stop that and change the multiplexer settings let's say you wanna reconfigure the text message here you have our text message let's say you have old text message and start it up now you see you get that old text message in the output box and you wanna overwrite that text message with a new text message so you see, the text button is not grayed out as long as you have a uh, going transmission. doesn't matter if it's over MDI or OFDM. Okay, now you go to the multiplexer window, say configure, go to the text message panel, say edit, and let's say it's not the old but the new text message now. Okay, accept that. Okay. Now we see here it's still the old text message until we hit that button here, text message update. And you see it flashes green, which means everything uh, was going fine. So after the fourth repetition, yeah, there you go. There you got the new, new text message. This, this applies, of course, to DRM over OFDM as well. Okay, thank you very much.